like, comment, and subscribe for more content. Let's go! What's cooking? Good looking. Welcome back to the channel. So, guys, I've been thinking lately, right? And I say that, and you're you're probably like, uh oh, right? Uh oh, what are you thinking about? Stop doing that. I know, I know, guys, relax. All this hype surrounding Terry Bogard, you know, he comes out in about a week and a half. It's got me thinking about characters that need to be in Street Fighter 6, right? And I'm not talking like, you know, my own specific wish list characters that I want. I'm talking characters that need to be in this game, right? And I know that's subjective, right? Which is why I hosted a poll over my community tab, right? Four characters, you know, who should be in the game, right? And I, uh... I don't know how long ago that was. That was about like seven or eight days, I think. And the results were surprising. Before I show you guys these results, do me a favor, leave a like, subscribe if you guys like Capcom stuff. If you guys like Street Fighter stuff, that would help me out a ton, as it turns out. Without any further ado, check this out. So these were the results, right? The four characters that I had in this poll. Sean, Makoto, Alex, and Sea Viper, right? In first place, we got Sean, right? Which, of course, you know, Sean is my guy. He's one of my favorite Street Fighter characters. Um, I think without a doubt, he's coming to the game, right? This artwork is from <laughs> Luke's arcade mode ending, right? So we've seen Sean, you know, an older version of Sean, right? I just, I, dude, I, he has to be in the game, right? I don't think he has a choice. And then in second place, surprising, right? Snatching up that second place spot uh, is C Viper, right? I like C Viper, right? Don't get me wrong, right? And I know what you guys are thinking, right? Oh, do you just like C Viper because she's hot, huh? Yeah, yeah, you're right. You got me, you got me. But she's also really cool too, right? She's like a secret agent. You know, she got the black suit on, and uh, it felt like, you know, they were gearing up to put her in Street Fighter V. She just never made it in, you know? And then, following Sea Viper, the surprise third place finish is Makoto. Dude, I thought Makoto would dominate this poll. Dude, where are all the Makoto fans at, dude? I thought everyone in the in the world loved Makoto and that she was like... <laughs> the way people talk about Makoto, she is like <laughs> one of the top three most popular Street Fighter characters. Right? But no, man. Uh, <laughs> she's third place on this poll. Uh, me personally, I, dude, I don't care about Makoto. I think it would be sick to see her as an adult in Street Fighter Six, right? Which is another reason why I feel like, you know, she doesn't have a choice. She needs to be in this game. Uh, her best friend Ibuki made it into Street Fighter V. You know. But no Makoto. Right? It's weird. And then, finally, in last place. But still, you know, a pretty good uh, amount of votes. You know, is Alex. Right? Alex is the main character of Street Fighter III. Um, and I feel like Alex didn't get a ton of votes. Only because... He was the first DLC character in Street Fighter V, right? So we, you know, we've had Alex recently. You know, I think, if I'm not mistaken, oh yeah, no. Out of all these characters, he's the character that we had the most recent, right? These other three characters, they were not in Street Fighter V. Alex was. Um, but aside from C Viper, these are all third strike characters, right? Street Fighter Three, and you know, we just want those characters to come back in general, right? Dude, I could I could sub out C Viper for Necro, and I'd be equally as happy, <laughs> you know. But these were the four characters that came to mind, you know, when I thought about characters that need to be in this game, right? Um, but we're not done. We're actually not done. I have another four characters that I feel need to be in Tree Fighter Six. Um, I just didn't <laughs> host a poll for them, right? So I'm not gonna you know string you guys along. The first character is Cody. Right? Of course it's Cody. Cody is the mayor of Metro City now, you know? And, uh, I mean, dude, Street Fighter 6, it takes place in Metro City. Metro City is such a huge part of Street Fighter 6. It's kind of weird that Cody, you know, we don't even get, like, an artwork of him 
you know, in someone's arcade mode or anything like that, right? There's a surprising lack of playable Final Fight characters in Street Fighter VI, you know, despite being in Metro City. So, Mayor Cody, I feel like he needs to come back, um, along with Guy, right? Guy's his right-hand man, right? The second main character of the Final Fight series, right? Well, technically, there's three, right? Cody, Guy, and Hagar, right? Guy, I've kind of always liked Guy, just because, you know, he's cool. That's kind of like the point of him. He's like a... <laughs> He's a ninja that wears, like, you know, he's got the Jordans on, right? Like, I, come on, man. Dude, just imagine RE Engine Street Fighter 6 guy in Cody. Just think about that for a second, dude. That would be so sick. You know, um, I just want to see them come back in Street Fighter 6. That's it. I feel like they need to be here. Um, you know, guy, there's a... They, they've alluded to Guy a little bit only because, you know, Kimberly is his student, right? So we got a little bit with Guy, right? So, you know, just like with Cody, just like with all these characters on this list, you know, those are two characters that I feel like they're going to be in the game eventually, right? They do not have a choice. They will be there, you know? And then following Cody and Guy, you're probably like, oh, dude, you're about to say Mayor Hagar, huh? Mr. Uh, Mr. Mike Hagar, man with the pipe. No, actually. Right, as much as I like Hagar, um, I feel like they should add Poison and Hugo to the game, right? Uh, Poison, she's a super popular character. Everybody loves Poison. Come on, dude. Come on. Dude, Poison's popularity has, like... Dude, it's, it's eclipsed just being, like, you know, a final fight enemy, you know? Poison is so popular, dude. She's got to be in the game. Imagine RE Engine Poison, though. Ooh did you Did you imagine it? Did you? Man, dude. <laughs> Moving on, though. Um, and then, you can't have Poison without Hugo. Right? Well, we, we did in Street Fighter V. But that's weird, you know? We had Poison without Hugo, and we had uh, Cody without Guy. And that's just, that's, that's wrong, you know? <laughs> we can't be doing that. Hugo, um, I'm not even the biggest Hugo fan, but especially after Evo this year, Hugo, <laughs> come on, man, come on, Hugo's kind of sick, I'm not gonna lie, man, Hugo's kind of sick, after Evo this year, I, come on, I'd much rather have Hugo than Abigail, let me just say that, you know, um, and also, the, the concept of RE Engine Hugo, right, Hugo being in Street Fighter Six. I think that could be pretty cool. And that's another thing about all these characters. Um, Street Fighter VI does a really good job of taking established Street Fighter characters and making them the sickest they've ever been, right? I think all the characters in Street Fighter VI, this is the coolest and just sickest they've ever looked, they've ever, you know, you know, moveset-wise, you know, a couple for, uh, aside from like, a couple things, you know? So I'm pretty confident that all these characters, Capcom could bring them back and make them look incredibly sick, right? And the whole reason why I'm making this video, aside from the poll that I just put out, is because we probably already know who season three is, right? Um, spoiler alert, if you guys don't want to, you know, talk about leaks and rumors and stuff, you guys can click off the video. I appreciate you guys sticking with me this long. Um, but there's this leak that I've been, you know, talking about on my channel. I've been on and off, you know, whether it's real or fake. But basically, there's this leaker, and uh, he's all like, Oh, dude, season two, you know, I've seen, I know the characters that are coming next. And we're like, dude, no, you don't. And he's like, yeah, man, Rainbow Mika and Vega and a new character. And we're like, dude, shut up. That's not happening. And he's like, also... M. Bison's coming back. He's going to have a cape with some scars on his face. And then also Alita's coming back and she's going to be wearing more clothes. And it's like, oh, okay, hold up. This guy might know what he's talking about, you know? And he's like, also Sakura, you know, she's coming back. She's going to look like Hakuto from the EX series. And it's like, oh, okay, this dude might know what he's talking about. He might be cooking, you know? So... I'm on board that leak. If you guys have been on my channel, you guys probably already know about that. So, we basically already know who Season 3 is, right? 
So I wanted to make this video talking about characters that like, you know, yeah, you know, this, this season three league is cool and all, but like these characters need to be in the game, you know, maybe Capcom does like an expansion, right? Super Street Fighter six, right? We're going to add like, I don't know, dude, some care, some, some, you know, characters that are missing, you know, that need to be in the game. Like, I don't, Sean, you know, I'm just saying. Anyway, guys, that's the video. I've rambled enough about potential characters that I want to see in this game. Um, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section below. Out of all these characters, who do you want to come to Street Fighter 6 the most? I'm genuinely curious. Anyway, guys, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace!